Away from that story now, the Secretary to the Government of the Federation, Boss Mustafa, has met with Christian leaders in Adama State over the gruesome murder of the Chairman of the Christian Association of Nigeria, Michika Branch, Reverend Lawan Andimi by Boko Haram terrorists. Mustafa, while lamenting uh, the incidents, assured people that the federal government would do all it can to rid the nation of crime and criminality. It was a visit expected to show solidarity with the Christian community in Adamawa State. The Secretary to the Government of the Federation, Boss Mustafa, described the security situation in the country as challenging, saying in the last few years, it has metamorphosed into several hydra-headed monsters. Several years ago, we started with the issue of Boko Haram restricted to the northeast. As we were making tremendous progress with Boko Haram in the northeast, issues of banditry started in the northwest. In the north central part of the country, the issue of intense farmer hardest crisis. Another dimension just unleashed itself. We were not used to, this, uh, to, to, to the violent crime of kidnapping. In the last one decade, it was too alien to us. But now it has become a major security concern. And that is prevalent across the divides, across the different regions of this country. So you can see that the security challenges that is confronting us as a, as a nation is multi-headed. You deal with one, another one erupts. Mr. Mustafa described the death of Reverend Lawan Andimi, who was recently killed by Boko Haram terrorists as unfortunate, expressing optimism that a group will soon be dealt with. We thought we had gotten over and Boko Haram had been degraded. Substantially it had. But we've seen a new version with a lot of vision, I mean uh, viciousness in some of the happenings. We acknowledge that. We are not totally out of the woods yet. The government is putting up a lot of things to deal decisively with that. It's a contention, there's a contention for the soul of our country. And this is where our collective resolve as a people is very, very important. The Adamawa State Khan Chairman, Bishop Stephen Mamza, while thanking the federal government for the show of love and concern, called on both Muslim and Christian faithful to do more, especially through naming and shaming the crime. Bishop Mamza said this would go a long way in telling criminals there is no hiding place in God's sanctuaries. We know the members of the Boko Haram claim to be working for Islam and on behalf of Islam. But we also know that this is not the thinking and also the belief of Muslims in Nigeria. And we also want at all the times that the Muslim community should also continue to disown such people. So that even we as Christians, if we have such people that are bringing a lack of peace within the community that happen to be Christians, we also will be able to disown them. If the Muslim community are able to come together, the good Muslims and the good Christians are able to come together, we support the security, we support the government in order to bring about peace in our country.